Hi everyone. I thought I'd do this quick video to tell you uh, some of the issues I've been having with the FTDI uh, USB serial port. Specifically, the fake ones. So, I've been doing some uh, interfacing with the Raspberry Pi. And here you've got uh, the Adafruit um, BMO, BNO055 um, IMU. And it's working fine. And on this section over here, I've got a Maxbotic sonar. Where is it? It's over here. Hooked up to it. And that's working fine as well. It's reading um, the distance. However, after running the Maxbotic sonar for like anywhere from 5 minutes to 30 minutes you would get this error over here showing USB generic read bulk callback URB stop negative 32 now I've tried different things from changing the power supply. Some people said that it's a power supply problem. Some people said um, to apply this patch to turn it back to USB 1.1. I didn't want to do that as I wanted the high speed USB because I was going to attach more things to this. And it turns out what I found more importantly is they're fake USB chips. Basically they are fake FTDI chips um, that caused this failure because I ended up buying a real one. Um, ended up buying this one. <clears throat> from um, the specific one here. The UB232R from DigiKey. And guess what? it works first time out so I have a couple more here that I have purchased haven't opened yet and I'm gonna try to see if they are they are fake ones or not because I bought these originally and this one was fake this one right here was fake so is this one I have a number of them and they're fake. How do I tell they're fake? Well, it ends up that their serial number ends up to be either zero or a really weird uh, serial number, which I'll attach in the link in the comments below. Uh, that's common apparently among the fake, <coughs> fake um, USB serial chips and they're like real FTDI chips. Well, fake FTDI chips I should say sorry that um, look real it says FTDI there but that's a fake chip I mean it's just a fake chip now I'm probably not gonna blame uh, Robojax or anybody for this I mean they're just reselling it although they do claim that it is an FTDI, FTDI <coughs> um, 232 chip. So someone probably should make them aware that they are being duped or if they're not actually duping, being aware of this already and duping people deliberately. Hopefully that's not the case, but let's give them the benefit of the doubt. Anyway, I'll be right back and um, I'm going to open these brand new um, pouches and we're going to test to see if they are fake or not. 